this long stretch of di triple digit temperatures, it means a lot of people will be dealing with AC problems in the coming days. Our Olivia Leach spent the afternoon with a local HVAC business on one of their busiest days of the year. All to find out what you need to know to prepare. When it's this hot out, you better believe that HVAC companies are swamped with calls. So I decided to ride along with one local AC technician to get a sense of what it's really like on days like this. Zane Larman has been an AC technician for about three summers now. Hot days like today are the Super Bowl for people in the HVAC business. When the temperature creeps into the triple digits, he knows to be prepared to work from sunrise to well past sunset. The technicians at Milestone Electric, AC and Plumbing have already received 19 emergency calls today alone for people whose ACs have completely broken down. But he warns it's best to not wait until your AC shuts off to call them. So the big thing is if it's running 24 hours a day, that's very hard on a piece of equipment and we're talking it's a matter of time before it breaks. Another big thing for me is if the AC is loud. Uh, quiet AC generally means that it's working well. The louder it is, you hear motors spinning, all that sort of stuff. That's a generally an indication that the AC is struggling. Marathon days like this can also be hard on technicians who often have to go into attics that can reach over 130 degrees to make repairs. But Zane says it's the smile on customers' faces when that cool air starts pumping again that makes it all worth it. In Rockwall, Olivia Leach, CBS News, Texas.